Hello friends, welcome to the session. I am Alka. We are going to discuss pair of linear equations in two variables. A given question is, Aftar tells his daughter, Seven years ago, I was seven times as old as you were then. Also, three years from now, I shall be three times as old as you will be. Isn't this interesting? We have to represent this situation algebraically and graphically. Now, before starting with the solution, I would like to tell you the basic idea behind the question. That is, a pair of linear equations in two variables, the x and y, can be represented algebraically as a1x plus b1y plus c1 equal to 0 and a2x plus b2y plus c2 equal to 0. Graphically, these two equations represent a pair of straight lines. Now let's start with the solution. From the question we see that there are two unknowns, Aftab age and his daughter's age. So first of all, let us assume their ages. Let the present age of after equal to x years and let the present age of daughter equal to y years. Now, we see that 7 years ago after was 7 years. Similarly, 7 years ago, daughter was present age minus 7 years. Now, according to question, Aftar was 7 times as old as his daughter. So this can be written as Aftar age was 7 times his daughter's age. Or this can be written as x minus 7 equal to 7y minus 49. This is equal to x minus 7y minus 7 plus 49 equal to 0. Or x minus 7y plus 42 equal to 0. So, this is our first equation. Now, again from the question we see that it is given that 3 years from now. 3 years from now after will be present age plus 3 years and daughter will be present age plus 3 years. Now according to question it is given that will be 3 times his daughter's age or this can be written as x plus 3 equal to 3y plus 9 or x minus 3y plus 3 minus 9 equal to 0 or x minus 3y minus 6 equal to 0. Let this be our second equation. Hence, the algebraic representation of the situation is x minus 7y plus 42 equal to 0 and x minus 3y minus 6 equal to 0. Now, we will see the graphical representation of the given situation. We see that the two equations are x minus 7y plus 42 equal to 0 and x minus 3y minus 6 equal to 0. Now we will find the two solutions for each equation. Now for our first equation, when we take 
x equal to 0, we get y equal to 6. And on taking x equal to minus 7, we get y equal to 5. Now, we will solve the second equation for x and y. Now, if we take x equal to minus 3, we get y equal to minus 3. And on taking x equal to 6, we get y equal to 0. Now, thus we see that the points A with coordinates 0 and 6, B with coordinates minus 7 and 5, represent the equation x minus 7y plus 42 equal to 0 and the points c with coordinates minus 3 and minus 3 and d with coordinates 6 and 0 represent the equation x minus 3y minus 6 equal to 0. Now, we will plot these points a, b, c and d on the graph. Here is the graph with x-axis and y-axis and the scale we have taken for x-axis and y-axis is 1 cm equal to 2 units. Now, we will plot the points a, b, c and d. A with coordinate 0 and 6. So let this be the A point with coordinate 0 and 6. B with coordinates minus 7 and 5. So it will be B minus 7 and 5. C with coordinates minus 3 and minus 3. D with coordinates 6 and 0. Now, we will join the points A, B, C and D carefully. Thus, we see that the pink line represents the equation x minus 7y equal to minus 42 and the yellow line represents the equation x minus 3y equal to 6. Now, on further producing these lines, they will meet at the point P. So, we can say that, thus, the two lines A, B and C, D intersect at the point P with coordinates 42 and 12. Hope you understood the solution and enjoyed the session. Goodbye and take care.